Welcome to part five in our series covering the urban soil health evaluation. In this video, we will discuss how to assess soil life at our site, which is found on part A of the urban soil health evaluation sheet. Contact us at the email shown to obtain the evaluation sheet. All right, so now we're gonna assess soil life. Um, and if you're looking, if you're talking about soil health, there's three main components to soil health. There's physical health, chemical health, and biological health. Okay. The best way to assess soil health is to take a shovel full and just see what kind of life you see in that shovel full. So you take it, you break it apart. Are you seeing, um, you know, burrows for insects, things like that? Are you seeing worms? Earthworms are a great indicator of the biological health of your soil. So in this particular soil, um, Not really seeing a lot in terms of earthworms. I am. But that can vary quite a bit, so you might have to dig a few different holes and take a look at it. There's some worms. But not much going on here. There's some insect burrows and things like that. So, um, so in terms of soil life, this would be um, probably... Uh, High-end, poor, low-end, tolerable, I would say. Um, but there are some examples. We pulled a sample just from over there, and there was a bunch of earthworms in there. So uh, just some things to look at. This one is a little more challenging to assess. You're largely going on earthworms, but you're, you're looking for other signs of life as well. So... Um, this one is a little more challenging to assess relative to some of the other categories. So for our soil, I'd give it a score of four for soil life. There wasn't much there in terms of signs of life. However, there were a few worms present. In the next video, part six, we'll discuss how to assess soil organic matter at our site.